guys, it's Naomi today. I'm here with my mum. Hello. And thank you for 100 subscribers. Yep, and welcome to our new subscribers, and we hope you like our channel. Today, what we're doing is make your make own, own rainbow, colored, rainbow sand. Colours, yeah, colours. And sand. all you're gonna need is salt, salt, and some chalk. <laughs> and here's some. We've made this one. And that one. And then my one. So this so we we've done orange. We've done orange, but is orange what is kind of brown. It is um blue. Blue. And then we've done yellow, red. Purple and green. I mean, with these, you can have any jars. We've got these little mason jars from Poundland. Or you can have baby food jars. So if you've got any children of your own, or niece and nephews, um, or friends that you know that have children, babies, that'd be quite handy. Also, we um, got um, this is a jar from a Mortiza spread <laughs> jar. So it's another one quite handy to have just to have some fun. This one. Are you ready? Yes. Go on. I can do it. I'm going to show how to do the thing first. I'll show you the salt. You can have any size little like, amount of salt you want. It is easier to do small You can have any size first. to start off with just a little small one. Pour it onto some paper. And then, then choose the colour of the chalk you want. colour of chalk, if I can get it. Oops. So I'll do uh, red. I'll do red. And then... So you can get the colour of what you want and how you would like it. So you can have it light or dark colour. <laughs> and if you want, if you find it to struggle, just pinch a little bit of um, in the pot and then just sprinkle it in. And then that will help it get, um, like, get the colour. Into the colour that we've chosen, and then we just pour it. Oh, <laughs> we just pour it into that. That's right. So, ready to make some? Yep. Nice. Some little spoons to pour them in, but you can actually as well pour it onto paper and then, oh, and then tilt it, pour it in. You can also have some fun by when you're pouring it in. You can have it straight, and when you pour it in, you can have it tilted to make any sort of design or pattern you would like. Let's get started! <laughs> and you can take the crayon out when you do it as well. <laughs> you put as much or as little as you want in. And don't forget to bring it down to make it go flat. Pardon me. And you can use, bit. and you can use the same spoon for the same thing. Need to fill it all the way to the top so you can 
so it doesn't move when you like so it doesn't move wait which one have I done? any purple? no I need this one first mum <laughs> I'm going to do a bit to the side so it looks like it's more coming up on the edge. <laughs> I need Purple? green. Green, there you go. Green. I'm going to have some yellow mellow. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how are we doing? No. Oh, I thought I'd really just do some more blue. I almost finished. I Actually, quite a cool effect, actually. Fun to make. Bye guys, that's all for the day. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you're new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. 
and turn the notifications on. Hope you try this at home. Bye! Bye.